we want to simplify the given expressions. Following the order of operations, we begin by simplifying inside the parentheses. For the first expression, we begin by simplifying 3x cubed divided by 9x. Looking at the coefficients, notice 3 ninths simplifies to 1 third, or simplifying out the common factor of 3, 3 divided by 3 simplifies to 1, and 9 divided by 3 simplifies to 3. So we have the square of 1 third, and then we have x cubed divided by x, or x cubed divided by x to the first. Remember when dividing and the bases are the same, we subtract the exponents shown here in the quotient property of exponents. x cubed divided by x to the first is equal to x raised to the power of three minus one, which gives us the square of one third x squared. And there's a couple ways of simplifying from here. Everything inside the parentheses is being squared, and therefore this is equal to the square of one third. And then we have the square of x squared, because we have powers raised to powers, we multiply the exponents, which gives us x raised to the power of two times two. The square of one third is equal to one third times one third, which is one ninth. We have one ninth x to the fourth. Another way to simplify this, going back to this step, would be just to expand. Because one third x squared is being squared, we have two factors of one third x squared. So this is equal to one third x squared times one third x squared, which also gives us one ninth x to the fourth. I also want to mention this expression can be written in a slightly different form. One ninth x to the fourth is equivalent to one ninth times x to the fourth over one, which is equal to x to the fourth divided by nine. So one ninth x to the fourth is equivalent to x to the fourth divided by nine. Looking at our second example, simplifying inside the parentheses first, negative four sixths simplifies to negative two thirds, or simplifying out the common factor of two, negative four divided by two simplifies to negative two, six divided by two simplifies to three. So we have the square of negative two thirds, and then we have x to the fourth divided by x to the second, which is equal to x raised to the power of four minus two. And then we have y squared divided by y squared, which simplifies to y raised to the power of two minus two. Simplifying, we have the square of negative two thirds x squared, and then y raised to the power of zero is equal to one. And now again, there's two ways to simplify this. One way is to square everything inside the parentheses, and therefore this is equal to the square of negative two thirds times the square of x squared, which is equal to x raised to the power of two times two. The square of negative two thirds is equal to positive four ninths. This simplifies to positive four ninths x to the fourth. Another way to simplify from here would be to expand and write this as negative two thirds x squared times negative two thirds x squared, which gives us the same result of four ninths x to the fourth. But again, I do want to mention this can be written in a slightly different form. Four ninths x to the fourth is equivalent to four ninths times x to the fourth over one, which gives us four x to the fourth divided by nine, which is an equivalent way to write the simplified expression. I hope you found this helpful.